Shakes. Skype. Stops console. Stop. Hello, everyone, and welcome to this edition of the Daily Blitz. This is the ninth edition of the Daily Blitz, which is a series of tutorials, tips, and how tos to get you going in Madden NFL 20. Sorry for the technical glitches that were occurring. Where I'm starting right now is the things to do to have a franchise, and I'd like you to go ahead and load your demo or your demo 2 franchise if you have one. Or if you have a franchise that you're playing with, go ahead and load that. And you should find yourself at the place where you need to be. Now this concept is going to be a little bit different. Today we're going to look at trading. And the reason why trading is a little different is that you're going to have to use OCR. So, here's what we're going to do. We're going to go ahead and we're going to do a trade, a regular trade. And in the next Daily Blitz, I'm going to show you some tips that you can use while being the owner in an offline franchise mode to kind of make the computer do what you want it to do because sometimes they just simply will not give you who you want. Now, I don't recommend that you do any of these. I don't recommend that you do this if you're playing on an online league that might make some people highly upset. But for this, let's go ahead and do a regular trade. I'm going to go to the team right adjust once line to up. team adjustment, and I'm going to go my, down my coach. to improve team. the very bottom, and then to the right once, and that says improve team. I'm going to press A. Team, you have two options. Free agents is selected. Now, free agency is a little different. It'll just bring up a list of players, and then you can press A on the player that you want. You can see all their attributes, uh, what their position is, how good they are. And then, you'll, and then you'll press A again, and then it will ask you if you want to purchase this player for a certain contract. And then you'll press, uh, you'll select yes, and you'll get the player. We're not going to demonstrate demonstrate free agency in this one. We're going to go down to manual trade, trade or to center. trade center. Okay. Press A. Entering here. trade center screen, you have three options. Trade block is selected. Now, trade block is where a player is on there. That people are interested in, in, in uh, it's a player that a, a team has put there in the hopes that a team will be interested in them. Manual trade. Manual trade is the one that we want in this example because we're going to go to. We're going to go and show you how to do a trade this way. This is the best way to do it. The other option is. Upgrade position. And this lets you select a position and then go and find a player to meet your criteria. So we're gonna do manual, manual trade. trade. I'm gonna press um, A on this. And this menu, by the way, is a horizontal menu. It goes left and right. Entering screen trade away list Texans. You have three options is selected. Now I'm on a screen that contains two different columns. Since I'm on the Texans, I have three blank slots. And I can either add players or draft picks here. But I need to get some information. I need to see who the Texans need. And menu narration Box console, companion is window. not going to read that. I hit insert up arrow with NVDA. So I'm going to press insert R. Recognizing result document. And we just did an OCR scan of this. And let's see what we can find out. I'm just going to scroll down with the down arrow here. Texans. Team needs roster size. LT, RT, OT. A left tackle, a right tackle, and OT that does not exist. That is a defensive tackle. Okay. So we know what they need. And it just so happens that I know of a good left tackle. Let's see if we can go get him. Actually, let's go for the. Let's go for the defensive Box tackle. Console. Let's go for the defensive tackle. So I've chose to go with defensive Trade tackle. Trade for list bears. You have three options: add player or pick is selected. And let's see what the bears have in it as it rates to defensive tackle. Entering here. trade list screen. Trade for left filter bears. Right filter all. You have 85 options. Came back low. 99 overall. But let's see what the one bears need here. Box console companion recognizing result document. Owner 22 M0 value we use them. Texans. Texans offer 2. 3. Team needs. 2. R3. OT. Cap room. Trade for. Bears. Wolf came back. Wolf. 
Allo, Mac, Age, Total Tackles, Sacks, Cap Hit, 99 FS, E. Jackson, K. Fuller, 28, 51.8 All, Cap Hit, 5 Point Cap Hit, 5 Point Cap Hit, 7 Point Chicago Bears, Bears Offer, 2, 3, Team Needs, 3, RT, Team Needs, Says Team Needs way down below here, 3, RT, 4, WR, They need a wide receiver, S. Roll, And they also need a right outside linebacker. So let's get a, de an, a defensive tackle, let's give them a wide receiver, and we may throw in a draft pick here. So now that I know what they need, let us scroll down, or let's do right filter, and let's do... Left filter bears, right filter draft picks, you have 13 yeah, options. I don't want a draft pick. And I'm just left holding filter down bears, the right left filter stick. QB, you have three options. And through the ski I'm sorry that this is taking left so long. Left filter bears, right filter HP, you have left filter bears, right filter FP, no available. Cl left filter bears, right filter WR, you have 11 options. A Robinson WR86. Left filter bears, right filter T, you have six options. T Bird and T80. Left filter bears right filter LTC Elena JRLT83 overall cap hit dollar seven twenty nine M is selected. Okay, let's go for him. No, I was gonna go with the D tack defensive tackle. That's who I was gonna go with. Left fil left fil left filter bears right filter Le you have three options. A hicks Le eighty seven okay, overall end. cap hit dollar. Left filter bears right filter TV you have two options E Goldman TG 85 overall Oh there's Left DT. filter bears right filter Left filter bears right filter TV you have two options E Goldman TG 85 overall cap hit Celia TV 78 overall cap hit dollar 77 M Okay we'll go with him We'll add him and I'm gonna press start I hit A to add him Enter and start Enter request a trade screen trade away it list takes us, You have three options is selected It takes us back to the trade away screen And remember we They need a wide receiver So I'm gonna press A Entering trade list screen trade away left filter All you have 88 options T Hopkins WR J Watlin 97 0 J Clowney rolled 92 overall cap hit dollar 60 L. Miller HP 85 overall cap hit dollar 62 M. Okay, let's see what we can do. Left filter here. draft picks you have 14. I'm go down to wide receiver. Left filter QB through. you have. Left filter HP you have. Left filter FBC Gillis PF. Left filter WR you have 8 options. T. Hopkins WR 99 overall cap hit dollar 12 5 M is selected. There's no way that I'm trading him. W Fuller V W R 82 overall cap hit dollar 184 M. So W R 73 overall cap hit dollar. W Fuller V W R 82 Sorry, overall William. cap hit dollar 184 M. All right. Press menu button Let's to see submit if the they trade. Want. So remember, on the right side, I'm asking for. Entering request a trade screen trade for list bears you have three options Celia TV 78 overall cap hit dollar 277 M is selected He's a 78 overall and I'm trading them Trade away list Texans you have three options W Fuller V W R 82 overall cap hit dollar 184 M is selected So let's see if they'll take it I'll press start Entering attention pop up are you sure you want to submit this trade offer? Yes. I went down once for yes, and let's see if they take it. Entering. Pop up the trade offer was accepted. Okay. So, it's... Entering trade I won't center say, screen. You have three options. Trade block is selected. I will not say that it is that simple all the time. You will have to play with what they're needing, what the team is needing, and what you'll do to figure out what they need you'll go to that right side you'll go to the right where it says trade four and you'll then hit a and then you'll do an OCR with insert R after you make sure you're in the right place in the window and then you will scroll down until you find what's needed and then you will go and see what you can offer them that was a fairly simple trade, but the more the more valuable a player you're trading for, the harder it's going to be to get that player that you want. You may have to throw in two players. You 
may have to throw in a player in two picks. You may have to throw in three players. You may have to throw in two players in a pick. I mean, there's just so many... You know, it, it's just, it totally depends on what you're trying to get. And sometimes, sometimes in regular trading, they're just not going to give somebody up. No matter how badly you want them, because the team understands the value of the player that you're trading. And so, you know, age and regression and things like that are also taken into consideration. And we'll, on the tips section, on the things that you can do to kind of give yourself an advantage against the computer, uh, when we get to that uh, daily blitz, um, we'll look at some of the little shortcuts you can do to get the impossible players. And they, they are dirty, I'll admit, but in an offline franchise, if you want the best, sometimes you gotta play a little dirty. And there, and there's no rule against this in Madden. They, they purposely designed it this way. Um, there's really no, you know, it's not an exploit, it's not a bug, it's just you manipulating things a little bit, but we'll get to that. And the Daily Blitz after that, we're gonna look at uh, cutting players and then cutting and contracts. And then after that, we may dive into Ultimate Team. Later on, when we get to the end of the season, we will take a look at the off-season uh, war and free agents. Uh, because bidding on those off-season free agents is important. But that concludes this Daily Blitz. And, you know, I just want to say that... Man upgrade position. Manual trade. What I'm going to do here is I'm going to go back... Because I got entering franchise I, hub screen improved team. Okay, so that was just a trade I wanted to try, and um, I hope that that worked out for you guys. So until next time, this is Ball for Life eight six five seven. Ops twenty three point five. Signing off and saying that I wish to see you all out on the gridiron. Also, we are starting a league. If there's any of you who have not given me your gamer tags yet, please feel free to do so, and I will happily invite you all. Coaches and owners and players are welcome, meaning the three different roles. And again, if you like what, if you like the content I'm giving you, please give me comments and give me some feedback. That helps me create more content like this. Thank you, and have yourselves a wonderful evening. Stop recording.